Hello, welcome to today's After Effects tutorial. In this session, we'll learn how to creatively animate the scale of text letters using the alpha channel of a footage. Let's dive right in. First, import your green screen footage onto the timeline. Apply the color key effect to remove the green screen. You can also use Roto Brush tool to remove background of your footage if it does not have green screen. This process generates an alpha channel, which we'll utilize for our text animation. Once you've generated the alpha channel, it's time to add some noise on our footage. This will help to randomize the scaling effect. Apply fractal noise to the footage, ensuring the type is set to dynamic, with contrast around 260 and brightness around 30. Under Transform, lower the scale to 60 and add an expression to the Evolution stopwatch by pressing Alt plus click. Type Time Asterisk 500 for evolving noise over time. Change the blending mode of Fractal Noise to Multiply to eliminate the white area. This will ensure that the scale of the text will be low in the darker area. Now let's create our scaling text. Create a new solid by pressing Ctrl plus Y and name it Particle Playground. Then apply the Particle Playground effect onto that solid. Under the Canon settings, set particles per second to zero. Under Grid, adjust the grid dimensions to match your composition size for even distribution of particles. Here, our comp size is 1920 by 1080. So, we will put this same value in width and height. Then put particles across and down values. These values must match the aspect ratio of the composition size for even distribution of grid particles throughout the frame. Here, we are putting values in particles across as 16 and down as 9. If we move forward in the timeline, we can see that particles are generated on each frame. To prevent particles from generating throughout the timeline, set keyframes for particles across and down values. Then, move forward one frame and set both values to zero. To fix the particles from falling, go to gravity and set effect particles from all to none. Next, click on options and select edit grid text. Type your desired text, ensuring loop text and use grid are selected. Adjust the font size as needed. To bring our text letters closer together, increase the particles across and down values at the first frame. You can multiply these values by 2 or 4 for tighter spacing. Now let's map our text to the alpha channel of our footage to create the scaling effect. Under Ephemeral Property Mapper, select Use Layer Map and set the source to Effects and Masks. Then, map the red channel to Scale and to choose Add as the operator. Adjust the max value around 4 to 10. You can also map other color channels to customize the text color, opacity, scale, and many more properties. And there you have it. With these steps, you've learned how to auto-animate the scale of text letters using any footage. Get creative and experiment with different settings to achieve unique text animations. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more future videos.